I honestly have no idea what we're looking for. Oh. Hey, what the hell? I don't think so. But it's a it's a key. You should take it and maybe you don't think so. It could be a clue. It, it could be. I want this plant. No. I want this thing. No. What about there's random lock knocking on outside? Just, I don't know what's going on. Not much help. Okay. Are those the only thing that we can pick up? This can't be a clue. It can't be. Yeah, definitely not a clue. go outside and look for stuff? Um, no, the music stops. But there's socks here. We need to work the home address again. Let's see here. Where can we... Oh? Oh? Can I look? No? I love this. No? I'm, I'm stuck again. I'm stuck again. I, I'm stuck. Okay, there we go. There we go. <laughs> Jesus Christ, he gets stuck way too often. Okay. Who broke this? Did you break that? So mean. Be so mean, man. Is there stuff out here? You gotta have it. There's random stuff on the floor. Hmm. There is nothing. Well, what else are we supposed to look for? I don't understand. Oh, oh, oh! If you sober up, you can find. So me and Jacob are apartment. obviously having problems. It speaks to motive. Crime scene evidence still weighs against it being the husband. Jacob could give us something to go on. One of my apps is drank like this to be feeling the back of my hand. <laughs> Call in burglary and get technical services out here. I'll talk to the neighbors. Oh. Don't think it's all dead about itself. They'll get nasty when I'm thirsty. I can talk to the neighbors. Cool. Uh, where should I head first? I'm gonna head to that blue house because I like blue. Requesting technical services for suspect in 459 at 142 North Union. Oh wait, it has like stuff on it. Whatever. Um, no? Guess not. Oh, hello. I knew it wasn't safe around here anymore. LAPD, are you acquainted with Celine Henry, Miss Horgan? Jennifer Horgan. I've known Celine for more than ten years. Our children grew up together. What's going on, officer? Did you see Mrs. Henry go out last night? Well, I'm no busybody, you understand, but Celine had been drinking, and she and poor long-suffering Jacob had a terrible row. I think Jacob may have given her a black eye. Oh. He stormed out, and she went back inside. Did he come back? No. Celine was listening to music and shouting until she left around 10 p.m. She was very drunk to have been driving. But she is not the sort of person you can stop from doing something when her dander is up. What is this about, officer? Is Celine all right? I'm afraid Mrs. Henry has been murdered, ma'am. Murdered? Oh, my God. I'm afraid I need to go and then sit down. Huh. Well then. Is that the only neighbor we're gonna talk to? Yes. Guess that's it. Hey, Let's see what Jacob has to say for himself. I don't think Jacob is our man, but we should see what he has to say. Okay. Whatever. 
Well, uh, I'll drive this time. You can have your cigar. Get in the car, asshole. There we go. Jacob Henry had a violent argument with his wife last night. He's looking more and more likely. Yeah, with my money, the broad keeps the house looking like that. She probably deserved it. Skipper says bring him in. Keep the hacks off our backs for a while. Fine by me. So it ain't the werewolf killer after all. Good to see you've come to your senses, Cole. I always said work the evidence. I only stipulated a connection to the BD killer as an avenue of investigation we should leave open. And as far as I'm concerned, it still is. Come on, let's go. Let's go. So it's not the quote unquote werewolf killer. Well, I should say quote werewolf unquote killer. War gun shootings? I'll probably do all the small investigations when I'm not doing a playthrough. So. Oh shit! God damn it. Okay, assholes. Sidewalk, who cares? I don't know where I am anymore. Shit, I have to go that way. Take the cable. Hey, a book here follows. <laughs> that was awesome. Okay. Okay, where is it? Okay, do need to go around here. I guess I have to go up a hill somewhere. Dude! Could you not? Well, no. go ahead. No? You're not gonna go? Okay. Calm down. It's okay. We're all good. There. I did hit him. He's fine. Yeah. He's perfectly fine. Hey! You're fine. Your car is fine. Oh, wait. My bad. We survive this. It's gonna be a miracle. I have no idea where it is. I think I know it's here somewhere. Hi, oh, sister. I was so tight I couldn't walk. Is it here? No. It's the uh, other one. Oh, it's right here. There we go. It's only a running distance away. Okay, Phelps, we go in hard. You follow my lead. We have to. <sighs> oh. You Jacob Henry? Yeah. Who's asking? LAPD. You're under arrest for the murder of your wife, Celine Henry. Murder? Celine? Save the dramatics. Oh, oh my for God. RKO, pal. You got bigger problems. What the hell are you talking about? You, you come in here, you, you tell me that Celine is 
Take a seat, Mr. Henry. But she's... We're going to have a look around. Uh, then we'll talk. Jesus. I'm sorry. Uh, I... I don't think he did it, dude. Really? You sit down? Okay. Fuck you. I get even the slightest hint that you're a flight risk, pal. The alcohol is... Alcohol is an illness. Well... Well, he moved out. Judging by the boxes. Um, you think the atmosphere is thick in here? Wait till you try the gas chamber. Okay. Go the there we go. I swear to God, you always get stuck on something. He'll be back in a moment. Just sit tight. Um Okay. Oh, 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 oh. Thanks for for the offer. I need you to do some something. The oldest problem there is. What to do about the old lady? Okay. He's definitely going somewhere. Size 11. Size 11. Wait. Was it a size 8? No. Oh. Can I open that? Nope. Uh, actually, let me look at the clues from the month. No, not location clues. Size 8, yeah. It was size 8 for book friends. Hmm. Well then. Is that a broom? No, that's a baseball bat. <laughs> uh, Incidental. Uh, thought it was a broom for some reason. Why? Thanks for the offer. I need you to do something about my wife. There we go. That's what it says. Not without. That wouldn't make any sense. So. Is that it? Can I talk to you now? So who could have killed Celine? Where did she go last night, Jacob? A bar, I suppose. Look, I don't know. <sighs> um, don't know if telling truth. Yeah, he's telling truth. You know that she drinks. No, Jacob. he's not. Monks have regular haunts, places they Damn feel it. relaxed. <sighs> Celine did most of her drinking at home. She didn't have many friends left. How many alcoholics do? Not real friends, anyway. Damn, missed that one. Oh well. <laughs> when did you last see your wife, Mr. Last night, I went to see her. We talked. Things got a little out of hand. I left. Now that is the truth. You don't remember yes. what time you last saw your wife alive? Look, I'm sorry. I left. Maybe 9 p.m. Might have been a little later, but right around nine. All right. Why did you kill her, Jacob? Things will go better if you come clean about it. That's a lousy thing to say. I never gave up on my wife. 
this? <laughs> the way you're shifting your eyes? That's a lie. I don't believe you, Jacob. I think you didn't have the guts to do it yourself, so you had someone else do it. You want to back that up with something, Big Mouth? Huh? Maybe about that... Um... No... Wait. The note by the phone suggests you meant her harm. You want the truth? Truth is, I was sick to death of her. I was... Trying to have her committed. Whoa, I got it right, dude. So you can prove that you came back here after you left your wife's place. I came back here. I was here all night. Start work at 6.30. Not the going out type. Damn it. I don't know about this one. <laughs> His eyes are a bit shifty. So you were here, tucked up in bed, while someone Damn, was out there beating your wife's brains out. That's all you've got? Talk to the bartender at the Bomba Club. He'll tell you, he called here last night, and I answered the phone. We're still gonna need you to come downtown, Mr. Henry. We can get this all down on paper, Jacob. How you got fed up with your wife, and how you figured killing her would bury all your troubles. Kill my own wife? She was a loss in a trap and you just couldn't stand it anymore. Shut your goddamn mouth. <laughs> so now you're gonna tell me you loved her? Ah, the DA goes all gooey over remorse, Jacob. Whoa, 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 whoa. Shit, 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 shit. Oh, shit. Squad car dispatched and check for messages. I'll keep old Slugger here company. Uh, uh, I know where the phone is. Uh, uh, uh. Operator, give me R and I. Putting you through now. Cole Phelps, batch twelve forty seven. I need a patrol unit to transport a suspect back to Central. Certainly, Detective. You have a message from the coroner. Do you wish to be put through? Yes, ma'am. Carruthers. It's Phelps. I've completed the autopsy. Several wounds to the head from a blunt metal instrument. Closest match would be a socket wrench handle. So the cause of death was the blunt? No, the blows to the head surprisingly were not fatal. Death was from hemorrhage and shock from the fractured ribs and multiple injuries caused by the stomping. Anything else? He's some kind of sex fiend. The tissues of the anus were bruised about one-eighth of an inch, but no trace of semen in the anus, vagina, or stomach. Thanks, Doc. Operator, give me R and I. Any word on an owner for that vehicle? License was 2Boy8899? Yes, Detective. The plate belongs to a brown 1936 Pontiac. Registered owner is one Alonzo Mendez of 402 South Fremont Street, apartment 16. Thanks. Any other messages? One, detective, from Captain Donnelly. He wants any and all suspects returned to Central. Interviews to be set up immediately. Got it. We're coming in. Go now. No, no, not clues. Fuck you. <laughs> God damn it. <laughs> Go there. I'll drive. For once, I'm driving. I'm not as bad as I used to be. Alonzo Mendez. Sound like a man who moonlights as the werewolf? Don't sound like a man I'd let my daughter take. You've got a daughter. Spend enough time drinking, Cole, you'll find yourself with any number of things. 
so, so that's why you never sober up. Exactly. Each receives a copy of the president's... His brother said she took a real pounding. Maybe if he had been a little firmer in the beginning, he wouldn't be in this situation now. I imagine that Neanderthal routine is a big hit with the ladies, Galloway. Women love me, though. I have no complexity. They know exactly what they're going to get. It is up to industry not only to hold the line on existing prices, but to make reductions whenever profits justify such action. It is up to labor to refrain from pressing for unjustified wages. You're getting better, right? That will force With the driving? In the price right. This is an age when unforeseen attack could come with unprecedented speed. I mean, I still make illegal things, right? That, that turn was definitely illegal, and I keep going over that side of the street, but you know. Uh, I'm not crashing into things. Well trained armed forces. And we must be able to mobilize rapidly our resources. Oh wow, that was an interesting way to cut it. Let us have the will and the patience to do this job together. Um, who are we looking for again? Um, I forgot who we're looking for. Uh, people. That's not helping. Shut up! Mendez. Alright. Uh, Davis, there's no Mendez here. Oh wait, my bad. I didn't realize there was another one. Mendez, sixteen. Mendez, apartment sixteen. It's on the top floor. Let's see. Let's see. Fourth, yep, fourth floor, sixteen. Hmm. Oh wait. Uh, go up the stairs. Go up the stairs. Go up the stairs. Go up the stairs. Okay. Uh, fourteen. Oh, is that sixteen? Yeah, it is. Don't bother knocking. Just kick the door in. Oh. Take a look around and see what you can find. Isn't this illegal? <laughs> uh, that's Probably nothing. Not. Yeah, that's a carton of eggs. I think that's important. Did you find something? I don't think this is going to help us. How do- why? Are keys not helpful for you? Hmm. Oh, wait, I should look for newspapers. Oh, wait, no, 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 no. Go here. Okay, what about this? This doesn't pertain to the case. Yeah. Let's see. Well, that door is golden. Well, the handle is uh, golden. So that means... There's a gun. So that means there's a gun. Yeah, that's that's it. Doesn't tell me anything. How? What do you mean it doesn't tell you anything? That's